Hi, I'm Valder Beebe. I'm the host and a visionary of That Celebrity Interview. Good day, and I want to thank you for staying with me this morning. I told you I was out getting my next guest. I've got Gatanjali Rao. She wants you to meet her because she's me. She's Time Kid of the Year. I'm so impressed. I can hardly talk. Gatanjali, welcome to the Valder BB Show. Well, thank you for having me. You are known as, uh, you came with the um, reputation of an extraordinary young leader, an inventor, a scientist, and definitely we need more scientists. So congratulations on being that Nickelodeon's Kid of the Year. Thank you. I'm so beyond honored and humbled to have that opportunity. <laughs> well, tell us why did, what makes you Kid of the Year? Tell me that. Ooh, I I think, I mean, based on what I've heard, um, I guess it's just my passion and my motivation. I've been saying recently that I'm a kid doing what she loves. And I think that that's really the message I want to put out. Anyone can be an innovator. Anyone can tackle the world's problems as long as they're passionate about it. You are going to be on the special that airs on Friday, December the 4th. What will my audience see from you on there? Ooh, well, I haven't watched the special either, so um, oh. I'm going to be watching it just when you guys are watching it. But I hope that you really take away um, just an inspiring message about what, what kids can do in harnessing the ingenuity of the youth. When you're put in a spotlight like this, are you still going to be Gatanjali? Are you going to turn into someone else like I see people do all the time? Oh, no, I'm definitely still going to be Gitanjali, this teenager who's just experimenting with science. And I think that that's, that's never going to change because I'm so passionate about what I'm doing. And I do love talking to everyone and sharing my story. Um, but I still think I will be Gitanjali because that's what makes me me. Oh, okay. You're very confident. Okay. I'm going to put this question to you. Someone on Facebook posted this. They say that Valder is a very unique name and I have a story behind my name. Gatanjali is equally as unique. Do you have a story behind your name? They want me to ask you. I do, I do. So Gitanjali is actually a poem, or a book of poems created by Tagore, who is um, a poet from who that my dad just absolutely loves. And actually my brother's name is Anirud, which is another one of his books. So we're named after that, but the, the real meaning of Gitanjali is actually offering of songs and melodies. And um, which is kind of fitting because I do play the piano. I can't sing to save my life, but um, I guess me talking is a melody. <laughs> Okay. So someone from Instagram wants to know that they've seen you on TEDx as a speaker. They're very impressed. How many times have you been a TEDx speaker? I have spoken on the TEDx stage three times and spoken on the TED stage once. You have such a resume at such an early age. I can't wait until you continue to grow. This is me saying this and see the things that you will create. We're living in a world now, and I'm sure people have always said this, where we need thinkers, we need scientists, we need inventors. How do you see yourself and the role in the future? Yeah, and just like you said, our generation is facing problems that have never existed before, um, like the climate change crisis, but we're also facing problems that still exist. For example, we're still at home because of a pandemic. But I think that we all have the power to make change. And just like you said, innovation isn't an option anymore. It's a necessity. And together, if we come together, we can make a difference. And we just have to believe in ourselves. Okay, I can't wait to see you on Nickelodeon special, but I got one more. My audience knows more about you, obviously, than I do. They want to know, with the current COVID-19 crisis, being a scientist or a future scientist, what would you add to that conversation? Ooh, I like that question. And I think... You know, it's so devastating that the COVID-19 pandemic has caused so many tragedies in the past couple of months. But if we're looking at the silver lining on the cloud, we have made strides in technology like nothing else. And that's 
in education system, governmental relations. Um, we're talking about social interaction, the future of healthcare. Even with these vaccines, we've made huge strides in technology. And now it's just for us to start applying that to our everyday lives and making even bigger strides in the future. Katanjali, it has been such a pleasure to have you to enter the space that I have an opportunity to talk to millions of people as they tell me across the nation. People have heard your voice. I'm so glad to have introduced you to new people because I know that you are a force to be reckoned with in the future. So we're going to watch you on Kid of the Year on Nickelodeon, and we will be there to support you. How about that? You've got new fans. Thank you so much. That means so much to me. <laughs> it means so much to me that you took time to stop by the Valder BB show and talk to our audience across America. We wish you the best awesome. that life has to offer, and we will be watching you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Hi, I'm Valder BB. I host the Valder BB show broadcast on radio and television, and this is my phone pouch. My phone pouch is a great invention. It allows me to go hands-free, pocket-free, purse-free, even belt-free. Head on over to myphonepouch.com.